gardening in July, what a great time of year to garden. It's a lot more fun to be in the garden when it's cooler and everything's growing and everything's vibrant. Here's a few things you can do in your garden in July. In July, it's a great time of year to plant some nectarines, some almonds, plums, a whole range of stone fruit. So those trees will all come mostly in pots and it's a great chance to get the varieties you love most that you see in the shop so often and you want to have in your garden at home. Put some mulberries in the garden, they're a great tree to plant at this time of year. Also, if you're further south in Bunbury, now beautiful southwest, have a go at a liquid amber, they're gorgeous trees. Or if you're around Perth, these jacarandas are very, very popular. Magnolias are a great tree to grow locally around Perth. There's quite a few really popular varieties of magnolia. We've got uh, the teddy bear, which is great for a cuddle when you buy it. And you've got the really popular little gem as well. It'll fill out a beautiful small cottage garden. So the perfect plant promise. If you're not happy with a plant or you feel it's not working out for you, you can bring it back to the store with proof of purchase and we'll refund your money. And it's valid for everything other than seedlings. So it's July now and it's a great chance to get a lot of veggies into the garden and herbs. Herbs like rosemary are fantastic. Getting coriander in is great. In July, we're in full swing, ready to pick our winter veggies. Cauliflower, silver beet, beetroot are all ready for the table, as well as carrots and leeks. Uh, July is a great time to get out in the garden. Just because it's a bit colder doesn't mean you can't get amongst it. You get to prune roses and remove any suckers from those and prune any vines to keep them in check. Feed your citrus in late July with some blood and bone to get them ready for that spring growth. It's also a great time to weed and feed your lawn. There's a few different options in store and we can help you pick the right one for your backyard. Mulch your beds with some lupin mulch to help stop weeds growing through and it's also a great feed for the soil when it breaks down. July is a great time to get out into the garden. It's a cooler month. You're going to reap the rewards for the extra efforts that you go to through the month. If you've got any more questions, just come and see one of our expert team at your local Bunnings. So click here for more gardening advice or click here to go back to our website.